Hey, watch it, man. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna try to get him at some point. Out of the vehicle, sir. Get off the bike. Get off the bike. Get off the bike. Hello, everybody. It is finally here. Five M Department of Law Enforcement. We are here. And of course, we have to start in the same spot. But yeah, sorry for like not a big intro and for being a couple days late. But anyway, let's get into this. So, all right, guys. Well, we are here in 5M. This finally freaking happened, dude. Um, I believe we have a fire right now. Oh, yeah. Actually, let me show you guys. Let me pull over. Boom. Look at that, guys. <laughs> we actually have a CAD. You see we have a uh, suspicious mail, we got a fire at the gas station. <sighs> Dude, 5M. So much better. But yeah, that's... Oh, does that... Uh, that guy does have lights on. But yeah, we are going to be just patrolling Blaine County tonight and see what we can get into. So we just got assigned to a possible robbery. Um, 3008. Alright, so we're responding to a robbery and control calling one eight one. One eight one, go ahead. Control calling two four three. Two four three, go ahead. Control calling eight two eight. Go for eight two eight. We're responding to a robbery. Control calling two four two. Two four two. I have you guys in route to 3008 Alhambra Drive, 3008 Alhambra Drive for a possible robbery, 1017 Color states that there is a man yelling at him from the front desk. Um, I, before I can get more information, the, the man at the front desk forced him to hung, hang up. If I could have you guys respond code 3. 10 4 be 10 7 code 3. So we're responding to a robbery in progress. Uh, I'm gonna downgrade just to not spook anyone. Three zero zero eight Alhambra. So it's gonna be on here, but where? It is Alhambra Drive, right? Alhambra Drive, yeah. See what this deputy's doing. I didn't. I bet that's Chris. This is three zero zero eight Alhambra Drive. Excuse me, coming through. Coming through. Hey, watch it, man. What'd you say? Hey, hey, sir. Hey, sir. Have you heard I any? Watch if I want to hey, 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 hey. Hey, I am. hey, so, no. hey, hey. Come here. Yeah. Okay. Wanting to win same traffic, I'll be searching the area. So that guy. I don't know if that guy's involved. Um. I don't hear any yelling. I guess it's going to be here. Is it at the 24-7? I'm not sure. We rolled up here. I saw a guy wearing a pink sweatshirt. He walked out of the 24-7 and started walking off. He's right there on that bike. Oh, that's him on the bike. Yeah, I don't know if he's involved. He. Well, I'm going to stop him anyway. I'm going to go clear the store. Watch, 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 watch. Yeah, I'm gonna be uh, getting that bike. That dude ain't getting away from me like that. Come on.
Come on, man. One eighty one traffic. I'll be on a ten eleven with a possible related suspect to that uh, robbery. We're going to be three zero 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 Alhambra Drive on a red sports bike. No additionals needed. It's going to be three zero 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 right in front of the fire station. Yes. D is the robbery like they say at the twenty four seven? Uh, I'm not sure. This dude sped off away though, so I'm gonna see if he has anything to do with it. Yeah, I was I was I was inside. The uh, the subject here was like yelling at the corner. I don't think he took anything though. He just left. But I'm not hundred percent sure. Yep. Well, uh. Just talk to the clerk to check CC if you wanted to. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. So yeah, so we're stopping this guy. How's it going, sir? Dude, look at the lights. <laughs> um, I could be better. Why do you want? Um, well, I'm stopping you because you sped around that corner, went in the dirt, probably were going like 50 or 60, turned on a Joshua. Bullshit. No, I saw you drive past us. Like, there was like five oh, of us on scene. Shit. Nope, it's Bullshit. not, sir. Can you do me a favor and step off the bike for your safety and my safety, and then we'll talk back here by my car? Um, I'm going to safely stay on my bike. Well, it's a lot safer you come back here. Step off the bike, dude. You're not you're not being arrested. Just step off the bike. I just want to talk to you in a safer way. I don't want you to run off on me like you did back at the 24/7 when I was trying to talk to you. But I didn't do anything. I'm just talking, dude. You did do something. You sped off, recklessly driving on this bike in the rain. Thank you. Now come hey, back here. I stepped off my fucking bike. Okay, Be come happy. come back here away from traffic for me. Now I'm getting wet. That's for your safety and my safety. You're not being arrested, you're just being detained, okay? What the fuck? What the fuck? You're just being detained, you're not being arrested, alright? Calm down. So what do you know stop walking away, dude. Come here. Talk to me face to face. Come on. Come on. You stand out like a dang burnt tree in a I'm California sure forest. I'm off. Okay, stop moving. Or else I'm going to have to pull you into my car, and I don't want to do that, alright? Huh. What do you know about that robbery that took place over there by 24-7? Uh, it wasn't a robbery. I was yelling at a guy that anyone would give me condoms and they had me trespass. That's you, what happened. So, I'm taking it and he would me. So it was you yelling? I told him to give me condoms to fuck my whore, and he said to, sh to stop using my, that language. One eighty one control. And I kept using the language, and he called nine one one on me. Um, apparently, he didn't like it. Be advised, the subject I have on this ten eleven said he was the I one yelling at the twenty four seven, but he's not claiming it was a robbery or that he stole anything. But he stated he was the one yelling. I mean, it's a search man. You can leave me on the robbery call, but I have uh, him detained right now if you want to send me one additional to 3000. 10-9. 10-4. Alright. Um, you have a knife. Go for I'll go ahead and squat you. For you. I can go ahead and Okay, so why were you yelling at the? Why were you yelling at the I clerk? To fuck my whore. I wanted to fuck my bitch, and he wanted to give me condoms. Okay, did he tell you to leave? Actually, he never did. Only the officer told me to left. When he told me to left, I left. Okay, can you face me when you're talking? I did what? Can you face me when you're talking? Thank you. Don't get too close, though. Yeah. Okay, chill out, dude. You should have faced you when you're walking <clears throat> away. Okay, if you keep moving around, I'm putting you in my car. I already didn't want to cuff you, but you made me cuff you. And I want to put you in my car. Your control. So you didn't steal anything, right? 
Because all he had was a knife. No, I'm, I'm an honest man. I never steal. I just want to fuck my bitch. Okay. Um. Side is stating that the quote unquote robber never took anything. It was just that he yelled and took his phone, hung up the phone while he was on 911, and left shortly thereafter. Okay, can I get you help me out now? No, I'm just listening to my dispatch really quick. Hang on. What are we waiting for? I'm waiting to hear what the deal is with you. They're talking about you over the dispatch. You're pretty famous. There's uh, Kevin, I think. Alright, um, just, uh, do you want to sit in my car to get out of the rain? Yeah, can you turn the air on? It's kind of hot. Okay. Which side? This side or the other side? This side's fine. Oh, you threw me in the other side. That kind of hat. Oh, well, you know. <laughs> okay, so basically, um, when I got attached to that robbery, he was running around with a 24-7, and I had no clue uh, where the robbery took place. But then he took this um, this bike right here and just sped past me, and then I stopped him. It took me uh, way over here to get him. And then I found out he was the suspect in that, so... But he didn't take anything. Hey, dude, is there anything uh, uh, inside your bike that I should be worried about? Um, I'm gonna be 100 with you, bro. Where am I gonna hide shit on that bike? Well, there's a little compartment where you put your insurance and stuff. Who knows? No, but there's a joint in there, to be honest. A joint? Okay. So you're giving me consent to search your bike then? Yeah, go ahead. I don't care. Alright, sit tight. Just talk to my partner here. I'm gonna be searching his bike. If I can spell right. <laughs> Dude, I don't know. Something about the lights is just so good. So, um. Ryan got attached to it. Huh. Some hey, loop. Be careful what you're touching in there. And a jeez. Oh, okay, that's interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna be straight with you. Might not be careful what you're touching. Might just touch like some kids. Um. So you were were you threatening the clerk at all when you were yelling at him? Because if he was, he's getting arrested. No, I was just telling him to give me fucking condoms so I can fuck my whore, word for word. Okay, thanks for the demonetization. But, um, how come you have a knife on you? You know it's dangerous out here. Yeah, well, when you're running, you know, yelling at the 24-7 clerk, and then you're speeding around on a bike, and then you have a knife, a joint, a bunch of very strange sexual things in your bike. It uh, raises some eyebrows. What can I say? I like fucking my bitch. What do you mean? Okay. Oh, you like it, didn't you? That picture of her was, that was her, the lube? No. Oh. It just spoils things up, you know? Okay. Well, sit tight, sir. Let's keep yapping away. Wow. Uh, Ryan, do you want to talk over here behind so he can't yap at us? Hey, sir, looks like you got more What's fans, that? that guy recording you. You want to talk back by your car so he can't be screaming at us the whole time? Let me out! Uh, Kevin, if you just want to watch him. If Ryan heard me. Ryan, did you hear me? <laughs> Ryan, come back. Oh, heck no. Hey man. Sir, out of the scene. Zoom out of the scene. Go. Sir, go ahead and across the street. Help! I don't. Help. Afterwards. Holy crap. I don't. Help. Sir, sh stop. Stop yelling. Just chill out, dude. Okay, well, I guess I'll tell you now. So, um. 
basically, <clears throat> Is I this wrote Marcus Peterson. I haven't got his ID yet, to be honest with you. I've just searched okay. him, cuffed him, all that. I was about to ask for the ID, but bas basically, Officer, it's me. Remember me? When I got uh, on scene of the robbery, he slid over my car, like ran over it and jumped over. He's like, "What's up, man?" And like started yelling at me and stuff. And then I went out front to talk to the other, uh, other officers to see what's going on. And then he takes that red bike and goes literally probably like 50, 60 past us and just runs the stop sign on Joshua, comes all the way back around here. And then that's when I found out he was the guy yelling at the clerk in the 24-7. So that's why I cuffed him and put him back here, just for further investigation. Okay. Do you need me here, since you already got two units? And he's in cuffs. Uh, no, did, I don't know. I can't hear some of the dispatchers. They're really low, so I might have accidentally said 10-4 when they asked if I needed another oh. unit. <laughs> okay, all right. I'll head out. Yeah, thank you, though. Am I, am I free? No. Hello? Hello? What did you say your name was? Marcus what? Peterson. Okay. I'm sexy officer over there. Jeez. Shoot. All righty, you guys yeah, are gonna. Yeah, just say um, that one guy just ran up to your officer in his car, so you might want to watch that. Marcus Peterson. Excuse me, officer. Valid. Has that motorcycle. He doesn't have anything to his name. Okay. Uh, you, you good over there, man? You hit by that tr uh, jeep. Freaking not Jeep bike. Yeah, 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 I'm good. I'm good. All right, here's the deal. All you got is yeah. a joint. Okay, what? Okay, see, I I'd be fine with letting you Wait, go you on a tick. No, I'd let you go, right on the spot. But why do you have a knife on you? That's the only thing preventing me from doing that. I legit, it's just a pocket knife, and you never know when you need a knife. Okay, you and didn't say it's a pocket a knife. Lot. Okay, well, if it's a pocket knife, what I'm going to do is, uh... What do you mean? How am I going to fit a big-ass blade on myself? I'm not, I'm not that dumb. I don't know, man. All right, so what I'm going to do, I am going to give you a ticket because you did drive reckless, but I'm not going to arrest you today since you didn't steal nothing, you didn't threaten the uh, clerk or nothing. So you're lucky on that part. Just sit tight while I write this for you. Yeah, he's really lucky that uh, I'm not... Uh, Can I get out now? No. No. He's really lucky that, uh... Yo420. Seems freaking legit. Officer! Officer! It was me, Trooper. Not stolen. Yes, sir, what's up? And, um... Kevin, you used... Why does your car smell like Samanda cheese? Use T to open text chat. And I don't know, man. Yeah, we're definitely going to take it. Alright, Marcus Peterson. He is getting a citation. So you guys actually get to see this stuff now. It's really great. <laughs> I have no clue how much I've wanted to do that. So citation. We're using Grove Street. Plate's going to be Yo420. Street name is Alham Drive. Alrighty, so we're gonna get him. I didn't clock him, so I'm not gonna get him on speeding, but I'm getting him on reckless driving. I couldn't see if he ran a red the stop sign. Alright, Mr. Peterson, look, I, c I didn't clock you, so I can't get you on speed. And I didn't see if you ran the stop sign or not because I was too busy trying to catch up to you. But you are getting a ticket for reckless driving. That's going to be a $500 fine. So let me ah, get you. Uh, yep. And uh, I am going to um, confiscate your joint because you don't have, you know, the medical license for that. So I'll put Why that. Me? If you get the scab out of your face, I'm going to take the scab and stop. Up yet. Stop. If you want to go to jail, you can keep you doing that. I, he's he's allowed to record. Just he can do it all he wants. But if you keep yelling at him, you're going to jail. Without my consent? You don't, it doesn't need your consent. You think we give people consent when they come up and record us? No. 
So just chill out. You're not going to jail. But if you keep yelling at people, you're going to. Okay, let me out, let me out. <sighs> oh, man. Don't yell, I promise. Um, I'm sure you are. Am I good to go? No, stop. What the heck? Get off your bike, dude. What? Get off your bike. You just said I was free to go. No, I didn't. Get off your bike. You're still cuffed. You had like an exorcist back. Oh, I said I was uncuffed, man. That's my bad. There we go. You're not free to go yet. Hang on. You gotta sign the ticket. Alright. You can sit on your bike, but do not drive off. You're not free yet. I'm confiscating the joint, because you don't need that, especially with your plate. So it's going to be a ticket for reckless driving. It's going to be a $500 fine. If you sign here, it's not an admission of guilt. Just you know what you're being cited for, and you're basically promising to pay for it and appear in court for it. Oh, here you go. Can, can you sign at the bottom, please? No. Okay, well, um, let me rip that paper out and refill it out. If you want to play jokes, you're going to jail. You drew a penis on the clipboard. If you want to play jokes, then we'll, you're going to jail. I don't think me went anywhere, but... Look, just sign the paper with your legal signature, and you're free to go. It's not that hard. You have to make it so complicated, dude. Thank you. Oh, I'm, I'm sure you are. You're lucky I didn't arrest you. If I see you speeding around again or doing anything, you're going to jail. Once we get back at our cars, you're free to go. Have a good day. Drive okay. safer. Don't drive like an asshole. <coughs> Make sure I submit that. What's this guy want? Sir... Go back, go back across the street, please. Yes, yes, it is. It is. Yes. I just, just want to come and introduce myself. I'm Andy Baxter. I'm a TV presenter and film guru for Reason News. I'm currently doing a show on how, how the heroes protect uh, our state. Uh, just wanted to see if you're interested in an interview. Uh, I mean, if you fix your mic, I could probably do it. Just a couple minutes, though. Yeah, sorry, sir. I said if you fix the mic to where I can hear you a little better, then we can probably do it for a couple minutes. One five four, you're clear to go. Ten eight, if you want. One eighty one control. Nice. I'll be code four ten eight off of that. Ten eleven as well as one five four. I have problems with the most. Stop twenty two it. Stop hitting me, dude. Man. You gotta really gotta really twiz a twitchy hand. Uh, yeah, it's really bad. Yeah, so sir, could you guys stick your name? Uh, it's Captain Nick with the San Andreas Hydro. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Sorry, I gotta go, I gotta go. Ten four. he just passed me. He's going in front of the fire station right now. I'll be trying to stop. Negative, he's stopping. You said he robbed the store with shots fired? Ten four. please conduct a code fire. Shots fired, robbed the store. Ten four. Code five along with two four two and one two seven along with two four three. Ten four. Final stop's gonna be right in front of the fire station three zero zero postal. It's gonna be Alhambra Drive and Panorama Drive. Turn one your one sirens one. off. Oh, 
He he's evading. He left. Ten, Running. Four, it's gonna be four, going. Two, four, Going eastbound, East Joshua Road, coming up towards Marina, kept going straight if secondary can take call outs. Holy crap. Joshua Road. I rate the speed. I'm gonna I'm gonna lose sight of you guys here in a minute. We need to speed by seas are too dangerous. Ten four, I'll take twenties till you catch up. Still going east uh, bound East Joshua Road, coming up to Route Thirteen in just a second. Speeds of about eighty five. Shouldn't have passed on the shoulder. Turning left onto Route Thirteen, heading northbound towards Polito. Two four, Just turned off. Yeah. If he keeps driving like this, we're gonna. One anyone be advised. Uh, I'm not making the decision yet, but we may have to terminate it. He's going way too recklessly, so if he doesn't stop, then we might terminate it. But we're going to be going down Chiansky Passage now. He turned off. Uh, he's going back on to Route 13. Guys, go back to Route 13, northbound. Don't go through the dirt. Yeah, so this dude, Marcus Patterson. 243, I got him stopped here. Uh, nearest postal, 2044 northbound Red Ocean Highway, mile marker G. Just past the intersection. 10 for him with you. Fleeing again, fleeing northbound. Ten four will be passing left on you guys. Speed's well over a hundred. Yeah, this guy. We need to get this guy. Honestly, should have terminated this already, but we're so close to him. Primary unit, what's your current speed catching up to him? Just turned into the wrong gas station. Going back around the alleyway towards Procopio, I believe. Polito Boulevard, Lost Eyes. Everyone downgrade. One eighty one control. All units have lost eyes. It's gonna be last seen. Wrong gas station near Polito Boulevard, Procopio Drive. If we can have a bolo out uh when ready, because I have the guy's info. Go ahead. Vehicle Bolo is going to be a red sports bike with a plate of 
Yellow Ocean 420. I have a person bolo as well when ready. Person Bolo is going to be last of Peterson, Paul, Edward, Tom, Edward, Robert, Sam, Ocean, Nora, first of Marcus, Mary, Adam, Rod Robert, Charles, Union, Sam. I almost stuttered on the Marcus. It's going to be a Caucasian male, 6'3 height, approximately 180 pounds, black hair, had pink shoes and a pink fluorescent jacket. Hang on now. Hang on now. Forty-three feet five. There's a bike in the Ron's gas station, Fleet Bay, that might match the description. Two highway units are on it right now. And four, it's going to have the matching plate. 181 is going to be out with it. And uh, whoever's behind me in the Explorer. Four, five, four. Sir, get off the bike. Get off the bike. Get off the bike. Stop. Get off the bike. Hands up. Put your hands up. 1070, he's running on foot. He's breaking into a vehicle. Stop. He's stealing a four door gray. SUV, he's probably going to be fleeing. He's deployed, he's deployed, he's on the ground. Close to 1012 Fleeto Bay. Uh, get out of the car, get out of the car, you're going to get shot. Get out of the car. He's taking the SUV. Taser has been deployed, but he's still going. He's trying to get out of the gas station now. Just 1050 with a HP unit. Now he's going, going to be going southbound Route 13, gray Ford or SUV. It's going to be a stolen vehicle. <sighs> Move, you freaking... Whoever's in this Vic in front of me, I'm passing on your left. Pull to the right a little. Passing left, Vic. Explorer and pass on your left when I can. This guy needs to be stopped. Should have arrested him when we had the chance. He <laughs> got a whole whole Congo line of chargers on him.
Man, AI suck. At least we're not going 115 now. In our 16 Dodge Charger. All over the road. Come on, we gotta stop this guy. What a way to start my 5M journey, huh? With like double pursuits. 181 would be secondary. The southbound CV road coming up to Joshua in just a second. Turning right on Joshua. Going to be continuing westbound East Joshua Road, just turn right onto Marina, left onto Alhambra in front of the gas station in Sandy. Westbound Alhambra passing the sheriff's office. Turning left on Panorama, crossing Joshua, continuing straight Panorama, southbound. This dude needs to end. Just hit a motorist. Yeah, this guy needs to go down. There ain't no terminating it now. We gotta kill this guy. Gonna be turning right onto Route 68. Pit was attempted, unsuccessful. 181 primary. I don't know. Just hit another bicyclist. We need to end this. Am I clear to pit? 10 for a win safe. I'm going to try a pit. We're going to be Route 68 still. He's going to be making a U turn at the customs going back northbound now. He brake checked. Unit who hit me, watch your speed. Oh, I'm gonna attempt to pit. Collided with two more vehicles on the side of the road. I'm trying to get up to pit, but it's not safe. Too many cars on the road. I added 1050 to do another car, twice still going. Pit attempted, he's still going, turning on to Alhambra. He almost he just hit a civilian on the side of the road. He's hit numerous people. I'm gonna go in and pit. There's got to stop it. Ten four. I'll try for pit one more time. We're on Algonquin right now. He's slowed down a little bit. Still pretty reckless though. He's turning on to the dead end road. Zancudo coming back towards me. Head on with me. I'm gonna be have I'm gonna try to get him at gunpoint. Out of the vehicle. Dude, out of the vehicle, you're gonna get shot. Out of the vehicle. One at gunpoint. Final stop three zero one one Zancudo ten seventy is running back towards Marina. Over the berm. Hands in the air. Stop. Give it up. Stay out, stay out, stay out, stay out, stay out. I've got the door locked. He. Barricaded inside a hole. It's going to be at 3009 corner. Thank you. 
man, this guy needs to. I'm gonna go get my car. So I got the speed zone. Let me position my car a little better. I'll grab my rifle. Can you use your CAD real quick? Yeah, this guy. And if the advised controls not back your channel, be advised. Color states that he has a hostage. If any officers enter, he will kill it. <laughs> kill it. <laughs> Seems legit. This guy is going to jail for life, dude. 117, do we know if this guy had a firearm? 10 for he Ten shot at the 24 7. 181 control, is there any way we can maybe call back and get a negotiator online to talk to him? Sir, you, sir, move. Leave. You need to leave this area. You need to leave this area, sir. Move. Get out of the area. No, sir, leave. 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 Sir, leave. Unless you want to get shot, leave. If you don't leave, I'm going to detain you and arrest you and pull you away from the scene immediately. You have five seconds. Sir. Five seconds. <laughs> five. <laughs> Ryan's mad. Four. Holy crap. Three. Two. Sir, leave. One. If he comes back, immediately arrest him and get a unit to pull him off scene. <laughs> Ryan was mad at that guy. Yeah, this guy is beyond, just beyond any remorse. My car's pretty busted up because I had to hit him a couple times. Sir, this is the officer to negotiate with you. Sir, can you hear me? Mr. Peterson, can you hear me? Marcus Peterson, can you hear me? 
control is he talking on your end? Negative. Mr. Peterson. Negative. Can you hear me? He's stating he's suppressed. Oh, he can't talk in this. Okay, one sec. Okay, sir, this is the officer to negotiate with you. Please, just talk to him. Listen, I'm gonna shoot this stupid bitch. No, Mr. Mr. Patterson, calm down, Mr. Patterson. Calm down. Calm down, sir. Okay, sir, you, sir, listen to me. You are completely surrounded. We have officers on every inch of the street. Can you just come out with your hands up, please? I'm gonna shoot the bitch in the head and she has blood brains than me everywhere. How about you cops just leave? Do not do that. We can't leave after everything you've done, sir. Just let the... The least you can do for us is at least let the hostage out, and then we'll work from there, okay? Uh -huh. I want at least... I want a car in front, and I want your cops gone, and I'll let the hostage go right there. Only way this is working if she dies. You really okay. want to let an innocent lady die right now? Well, you've already killed two innocent people, so... Um, you want them to be a threat? Is that what you said? You no. Be so you want a car. So you, don't care? so you want a car. I just want a nice car in front of the house. I will leave. As soon as I'm in the car, she'll be able to leave. Well, unfortunately, we can't leave uh, the whole scene. We can get you a car. Let me drive off. What? Uh... We can't just let you drive off, man. Just let the hostage out and we'll give you a car. We can't let you drive off with a hostage. If I can get this deputy in front of me. Officers going by the door. Stop. The caller said if you get closer, they're going to shoot. Okay, I told him to stop. Just calm down. Can you please let the suspect go? Officers going up by the door, back off. The caller said if you get closer, he's going to kill the hostage and then shoot you guys. Okay, I told them to back off, sir. Can you please let the hostage out? I did something for you, now you do something for me. I'll do something for you. Let me get, get out of here. Not that hot. Okay, well, just let the hostage out and we can work with you. It doesn't have to end this way. I am being nice, that's why you're still breathing. Can you just please come out of the uh, trailer with your hands up, or at least let the hostage out? We're not going to kill you if you let the hostage out, as long as you come out with your hands up. Listen, Trooper 181, whatever you is. Just give me a car, it's really not that hard to ask for. Let me out, please. Well, after you've stolen a car, hit numerous people, and fled from police for 45 minutes, it is hard to do, sir. I don't want it to end like anything. I want you to let the hostage come out, and you come out with your hands up, leave the guns inside, leave whatever dangerous weapons you have inside, come out with your hands up. I can't go to jail. I can't. Why can't you go to jail? Why can't you go to jail? Okay. Well, I need you to please let the hostage go, and then we'll work from there. Let the hostage out. We'll take her back. I'll call you back. And we can work out a deal once the hostage is free, okay? No, we're working on a deal right now, believe me. I, 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 if you, if you really know who I, I, I ain't stupid. Just okay. Put, okay, I'll make it easy. Bicycle, on the stairs, that's it. I can't send an officer up to the door after you've been shooting all day. Look, okay. <laughs> As much as I want to give you what you want, you have to give what we want first. You gotta let the hostage out first. Hey, your car's on fire. Hello? Hey, I can, I can get you out of there. How? I'm, I got my car. Just make a dip. Make a dash. Where's your car at? It's, it's staged on Island Avenue. <laughs> 
<laughs> Car's on fire. Control, can you move me back to dispatch? I'm hanging up. I'll call you back in a second, sir. Be advised, um, subject wants a car or a bike before he lets a uh, hostage go. I told him we can't do that, told him to let the hostage out first. He's refusing, and then I heard him on the phone with someone else before I hung up. So just be cautious. Don't approach, because he said he'd shoot us and the hostage. Um, We also have someone. Oh, T taser deployed. One tase, one tase. Someone get that vehicle and stop that. Stop that vehicle. On the ground. Hands up. Hands up, dude. I'm not playing with you after this. Put your hands up, or I'm gonna shoot you in the back. Hands up. Hands up and on your knees. I'm trying, I'm trying. Better get on your knees before I tase you again. Just for that officer's sake. Going for another taser shot if he's not on his knees in five. Dude, get on your knees, four, dude. Four, I'm trying to get it's not working. Two, <laughs> one. Just get on your knees, dude. Hey, God. Jeez. Uh -oh. Where's your weapons? You're gonna go clear the house. I left them in the hostage. With the hostage. I'll clear with you guys if you yeah, want to stack up. Alright, everyone good? Yep. Alright, move up. Yep. Howie Patrol, if anyone is in here, put your hands up. Clearing right. If there's anyone in here, make your, make your presence known. 181 trailer is clear. One seventeen, I just got hit by that vehicle. Oh, that vehicle is lucky my car had to get deleted or I would have freaking went after that guy. Now let me get my car back, guys. Two forty three, I've got that vehicle. I'm gonna be in pursuit of it right now. East northbound Joshua Road. Heading up towards Is this your the charger? At this time. Uh yeah. All right, I'm gonna throw him back here. Put my Should AR away. The pursuit, since only two unit. Yeah. All right. It's gonna be northbound Route 13. Do you want me to go over there just as a supervisor or no? Yeah, it's me. I'm just gonna finish searching him and then place him in the car. I got knocked, swept off. My feet. Yeah, are you good? Did anybody else get hurt? Vehicle's gonna be northbound. Sorry, right, twenty-two. Ow! Arm twitch. I'm sorry. <laughs> Arm twitch. <laughs> um, be advised, he did. I'm not sure if they're deceased or not. I don't know if we had any officers check on him. He did hit two motorcyclists, ran into probably like yes. nine or ten cars, stole a vehicle, shot numerous times, fled for like 45 minutes. Uh, yeah, he's going to jail for life. <laughs> I'm gonna go try to catch up to that pursuit. Are you good? Yeah, uh, I think we should be good with just me and uh, John here. 
Uh, ten four. And medical. One forty three vehicles ten fifty. It's gonna be ten seventy now. One eighty one's in route. A black jester. What's your guys twenty? I'm in route. Suspect vehicle. He's gonna be a black jester now, heading southbound U.S. Route thirteen. He should be exiting the tunnel about at about this time. Ten four one eight one's in route. Yeah, well, it's been a chaotic night. Are you guys in southbound or northbound lanes? Last seen southbound lane for 10 0 at this time. 10 4. Did he steal a vehicle? 10 4. He stole a black jester. 10 4. I just saw that stolen vehicle turn right onto East Joshua Road, all blacked out, trying to catch up. I don't know where they went. Be advised, the subject did have a pistol in hand while he was stealing the jester. 10 4, I lost eyes. Last seen going down East Joshua Road. Unknown where they turned off. Ah, oh, man. I feel like they turned off somewhere trying to hide from me. This is going to be a long episode. <laughs> I wanted to keep episodes short, but if it's going to be freaking six pursuits, then heck. Does anyone have eyes on that stolen vehicle? What's your street? for. Yeah, I don't know where that vehicle went. I guess I'll go search up here. I don't know where they went. I don't know where they could have went. They probably turned off somewhere up close, honestly, because I didn't see him going straight. One seventeen, dude. We get a name on the guy that we're arresting. The one you have on scene with you, Marcus Peterson. Ten four, if you want me to. Ten four. Alright, so we're going to be writing the arrest report for that piece of garbage. Marcus Peterson, new arrest. Uh, we'll leave that blank. I don't know where he's booking him. So first off, we're going to have felony evasion. We have felony speeding. Have assault with a deadly weapon. Attempted murder. Um, vehicular manslaughter, because I'm pretty sure he killed some of those people. Um, destruction of government property or private property. Destruction. I guess, would a car be public? I do public property. Um, do kidnapping. He technically held a hostage. So we got felony evasion, felony speeding, assault with a deadly weapon, attempted murder, vehicular manslaughter, destruction of public property, kidnapping. Um, did 
discharge of a firearm in public. And threatening. I guess we can put. Ah, uh, no. All right. Well, I think that's. I think that's good. We got felony evasion, felony speeding, assault with a deadly weapon, attempted murder, vehicular manslaughter, destruction of public property, kidnapping, and discharge of a firearm in public. So have fun being arrested for forty-nine days. All right, guys. Well. Can you please bump that up to Google? That would be a good time to end today's video. It's going to be a long one. But I do hope you guys enjoyed and expect to see a lot and a lot more of 5M. Go ahead, 170. Have a great day, and I'll see you all later.